Hi everyone, my name is Mehdi. Today we are going to see how we can export a document type definition or XML schema from an already created XML source in Power Center 9 and above. Today we're going to go over these topic, possible scenario difference between XML source export and schema export, extract DTM or XML schema from an XML source in Power Center Designer. So let me search back to my designers and go over to detail. So one of the scenarios that uh, this tutorial may be helpful is let's say a while ago one of the developers created an XML source with a DTD file or an XML schema and now we cannot find it to edit uh, or to see the underlying code for troubleshooting purposes. Now let me show you the difference between object export and schema export. When I go here and right click on the XML source object and hit on export object and save, PowerCenter create an export of that source object. It is not the schema behind it. Let me show you the file. So if I double click on the created file, you can see this XML file is ready to import in a different folder or a different repository and has nothing to do with the underlying schema. So to capture that we have to follow these steps. First right click on the source file and click on edit XML definition. It brings you to this page. When you're here go to the view menu and XML metadata. Now you have the option to choose between DDT DTD, excuse me, and the XML schema for the specific namespace you have. So let's first go to the DTD. This is going to be the DTD and the underlying schema behind the XML source that I have. If I want the XML schema, I can simply go back and click on the namespace. I want that, and you'll see the schema here. You can save the file for further study or editing it for later use. So let's go back to my presentation. We covered the possible scenario that we lost the underlying code and we want to troubleshoot some stuff. Uh, we show you, uh, I showed you the difference between XML source export and schema export. We exported a DTD and we exported an XML schema and we covered it. We really appreciate your feedback. You can email us or follow us on Twitter at twitter.com info support. Thank you for watching this and have a wonderful day.